Hello, my name is John Robbins and I am Business Development Manager at the CSA Catapult. Apologies for not being able to present this live and take questions, but our contact details are at the end of the presentation. CSK Catapult is the newest of all the catapults with an initial funding of £53 million in 2018. Since then, the Catapult has employed over 100 people and built a state-of-the-art open access innovation centre that opened in 2019 in Newport, Wales. We have engineers with over 30 PhDs and over 705 years of relevant experience. Today, we have started work on over 25 collaborative R&D projects involving more than 100 partners, both from industry and academia, which are currently valued at £177 million. This rapid growth shows the market demands and adoption of compound semiconductors in the industry. We're also very proud to have become a DER industrialisation centre as part of the UKRI's Driving the Electric Revolution Challenge. And in early 2020, we became one of, if not the first catapult to become registered as a KTP knowledge base and can now work with universities as a shared knowledge base or direct with industrial partners. Our key markets are automotive, clean energy, digital communications, defence and security, and many, many more. Our innovation centre, located at the heart of the compound semiconductor cluster in South Wales, is home to a design studio, laboratories and test facilities. Our engineering capabilities focus on modelling, characterisation, integration and validation and we call this as MCIV. This enables us to engage with companies and universities in a variety of projects at different TRL levels, from device packaging, engineering design, support and consultation, testing, simulation and thermal modelling. Internally, our engineering teams are split into four main technology areas that closely align to key applications for compound semiconductors. These are power electronics, which includes power device characterization, environmental and lifetime test and failure analysis, alongside modeling simulation and complete system test. RF and microwave focuses on RF power and low noise amplifiers, including device characterization with on wafer measurements possible. Photonics focuses around pick test and assembly, reliability and lifetime testing. We also have an advanced packaging lab in a class 10,000 clean room where we can do device and component assembly from die attach and wire bonding, submicron assembly and inspection capabilities, including X-ray CT. We have some capabilities unique to the UK, such as hybridization and come in early in 2023, ceramic and 3D metal printing. The key areas of focus for as an organisation and for research and residents aligned to our strategic company focus on applications for clean energy, electrification of transport, digital communications and intelligence sensing. Specifically, the engineering focuses that we'd like to engage with you include next generation power solutions from grid to automotive drivetrains, for our photonics team that has strong expertise in quantum applications and supporting UK skill and technology readiness across the 5G supply chain. As a catapult, our job is to enable design activity across both academia and industry as a neutral supply chain convener that enables multiple end markets and encourages fertilisation of ideas. We are keen to engage with you as part of the Researcher in Residence programme or in any form of commercial or collaborative project. So please do reach out to either myself and as I said at the very start of the presentation, the contact details for Alex, our Skills Academy Manager, is on this slide. Thank you.